mystery machine. Stay out those. Ooh, I got the new 70s collector. There's. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, I got majorettes. New colorway of the Scion. We haven't even hit the road yet, and I'm already just going by. Oh, look at this thing. Monday, huh? Another Porsche. A white Taycan. A white Taycan. A white Taycan. Right. Ghostbusters. Look at the Ghostbusters. Ecto-1. Really cool. I don't know. I know there's... I don't think there's chases in Jada's. Oh. And he's got a belt buckle. You freaking kidding me. bunch of DK stuff. Always gotta check. Nothing I don't have already. Come check it out. Check, check, check it out. Oh, never seen this thing. Rock and railer. Flagship International Case stuff. HW Four Track. Right on. Oh, check out the view. I don't know why I haven't seen that one. Oh, got the colorway Tony Hawk jump. Uh, 
conducting That's it. Just because it's a treasure hunt. That's a cool auto world. That Mustang. Caddy Alvarado, another Mustang. Alvarado. What else we got here? The Hooker. Okay, I've seen this series. Yeah, I've seen this series. I haven't seen that firebird though. Mallory. 68. You don't see too many 68s either. I don't really think about that. Another 68. Another 68. Oh, God. Oh. Some auto strauss. Needs to be. Uh, there's some speed machines too. So gonna, oh, Mandalorian. Got a new set. Here's the rest of the auto straws, just all Alpines. But the Mandalorian stuff. So there's another set. Thank gosh, there's no Volkswagen. I don't need any. This is cool though. That's pretty cool. For Star Wars stuff. Over here, so I'm just gonna stop this set off to the side. Old case, uh, D case. Wow, D case, Idaho. Pardon me, Captain. Egypt. This looks like, yeah, it's all D case stuff. Yeah. Smelterville. I can't think of anything from the D case I need. The five packs are pretty quiet. Cool party as well as the matchbox release a new five pack. Oh the Lamley. Bouncing. Jeez. That was a vicious fallen soldier. Uh, I don't think there's any of these that are new. Nope. I don't think I try. Oh. Uh. <laughs> I wonder what the car was. Or the two cars. But they took it off the price. F case. I'm pretty sure I'm happy with what I found in F case. And when he keeps aligning them all, this must be a 
someone's signature, rather. Ooh, speed machines right here. Thirty-six bucks. Forty bucks. Everything <laughs> except <laughs> the Porsche. Uh, nothing. <laughs> Another Batman set. Gosh, just really just milk the hell out of this. Pretend to chase. Love those. Lots of moving part stuff. And the Morris Minor. Got that Porsche again. Love that thing. Maybe. And maybe. Oh, no more of these. I guess no Dotsons. Mm hmm. Do you have a Jack Skellington car? Porsches? That's too bad. <laughs> That's the way. Ooh, Thunderball. That is cool. But I got the Hot Wheels version, so do I really need to be messing with that? There's some pop culture. It's a clue detective game. is pretty cool and so is this. I need a, a, a bazooka. Yeah, oh, look at that Camaro. Oh, damn it. Thought it was a... Thought it found me some firebirds. Oh, I just saw that come from. Like they got nothing else. A bunch of weirdos walking around the store. Two Mach 1. Ooh, a new Dodson. That's pretty tight. I don't know if it's as nice as the other one. Surf Maniacs. Mm. I'm just not buying that scale. Red Meyer. And a Batmobile's will get me every time. I always think it's a super. These are old case stuff. And a whole bunch of older case stuff. Yeah. Oh. What is this? I have to do that. Might get my own Jaguar light body E type. Oh. Do you got the Bragos? I got all these. Of course, I don't have the Red Bull one because fuck you, Max Verstappen. Muscle transports, can't say I've seen those before. That was really cool. I do 
a pretty good job on Deco. Till and go. I still make some cool stuff. Some more muscle machines. Crazy 2023. Oh, Pizza Hut Volkswagen, that thing is so cool. Fallen soldier. Rest in peace. Just the boat. Old case stuff. Dang it. Super rig. Mustang. Oh. I guess the Nissan 5-pack is probably what we're looking for. Look at all these cool Hot Wheels I haven't seen yet. So they're just putting them in this new packaging. Oh, another one of these because I just opened mine. 15 bucks. You find any cool ones? Yeah, um, yeah. Five packs are on sale for $4.99. That's right. Nemo car. Those are cool. Look out, ski resort. Trout, rainbow, round trout, cutthroat, bully, and a bully. Can't keep the bullies. Oh, you got me. Oh, a little fish in a little racetrack. Super cool spinny will. So let me say a big thank you to, and this is the most, uh, the most people we've had in the, in the giveaway. Stoked. Uh, looks like twelve people. Mike S, E D, Ruben L, Lamar B, Edward E, Richard J. Always up in there. Alex G. Good to hear from you, my G. Chad F, appreciate you. Um, Ruben L, though, you're a G. He was a little clever with his donation. Uh, Fatima H, thanks for coming back, Fatima. I pre I hopefully, hope, hopefully you really do like the show. Hope I'm doing you some justice. Uh, Daniel S, you already won. You're a G. Coming back for more. Cool Kurt K, all right. And Stephen P. Stephen P, my guy, donated right after the time, but on time for this week's. So, let's get through this. I've got the drawing for today. Everybody's in the wheel, I believe. I'm ready to party if you are. Let's see. Chad, Chad F1. Can you believe that? Chad F1. 
He just wants more treats. But Chad F, you should be stoked because you won, my G. Congrats to you. You got to DM me your uh, coordinates so I can get your box out this week. Because tomorrow I'm sending all these boxes out. I got boxes. Unboxes. And I kind of overlooked sending them before I left to Idaho. But Idaho was a good rip and a good visit. If you guys live there. Um, I was very polite to your pegs. And... My name's Walter. This is Oso. Welcome to the Hotline of Diecast. Bear with me while I get the critter a treat. Alright. Man. I love my dog. <laughs> my dog's a G. Yeah, it's just so cool. It's cool to have a relationship. We got this routine we have, obviously. But it continues on out there. But, uh. Just with a G, and the way he watches after my kid, shepherds have that that genuine, loyal, and protective instinct about them, and, you know, single pop, I appreciate that noise, but, uh, woof, was on a long rip, we took a trip to Coeur d'Alene, what a genius little spot, man, it's smack dab in the middle between wilderness and future progressive vintage you know like seattle is it in reach if you live in Coeur d'Alene, a lot of people live in Coeur d'Alene and work in spokane obviously you can come to places like montana uh, pretty quickly and easily and that's what's up i enjoyed it the lake is epic cool cool spot um yeah, did some gut hunting there as well. Well, at least on the way there. Hold on, let me see what's up with the pup. Something. There's an animal of some sorts. But I uh, did some good hunting. Really stoked on what I what I bumped into. It was uh, pseudo random, but uh, I'll show you guys what I got. How about that? How about uh, first up? Finally scored myself the Porsche 911 GT3 from the Speed Machines. And actually got two. Got one to open. You guys can just see. It's just those coal molded wheels and the 60 livery on the hood. The headlights. They did very well on this. Good job, you hot veals. Good job. Uh, so I needed that for the set. Um, I also bumped into a Fast and Furious Nissan Skyline, but I think it's out there. So you guys have seen that car before. Needed to have Toyota 2000 GT, the Roadster from You Only Live Twice. Had to have one to open. Thank you. Got that. Went to, um, let's see. What else did I get? Wait, where's everything at? Oh, here we go. Finally bumped into the Volkswagen set from Matchbox, a new drop. I was looking for the Porsche one, kind of overlooked the Volkswagen, or forgot about the Volkswagen, but number one is six. Type 34 Carmen Ghia. Just a beautiful car styled right. They did pretty good on it. Way to go, Matchbox. Number two in the lineup is, pardon me, there you go, the 76 Volkswagen Golf GTI Mark One. You know it's Mark One because it's got single round headlights and no tail lights. Damn. The Grand Touring Injected GTI. Number three, another Carmen Ghia. Good job, Matchbox. I feel like this car never gets its due. But in this case, it does. So here's your 62 Gia. They did finish the back on this plate and all. Number four is a Volkswagen thing, but actually known as a Type 181. They've made a number of these. A number of the Carmen Gias too, you know. These Matchbox doesn't sleep on Volkswagen. They do pretty good. I don't have number five, which is the lifted, pardon me. There you go, which is that Beetle 4x4. 
but I do have number six, which is the, uh, excuse me, 62 Volkswagen Beetle. Volkswagen, the people's car. Thank you, Ferdinand Porsche. And that's why I get on the Porsche thing. Because if he were to introduce himself or his family, they would introduce themselves. Bob Porsche, you know. So that's why I get on that. But if you own one, you can call it a Porsche. That's a rule. That's a rule. Let's see. Let's see. What else did I get? I got some other stuff, didn't I? Not really. I guess I got these. Really hyped on it, though. Matchbox Day. Matchbox 70th anniversary. There's the Volkswagen, or excuse me, <laughs> the 2002, well, it is a Volkswagen, Audi RS6 Avant wagon. Oh, well, Avant mean, is wagon, so. They did really good on this casting, too. You guys can see it. Behind that, the Toyota 4Runner. I love this one. And you know, the silver, the gray and black and orange is, is a pretty apparent homage to Matchbox. It's always been their colors and they are celebrating their 70 years by utilizing all three. Here's a really strong car in a collection, excuse me. 1971 MGB GT Coupe. Or coupe. Did a really cool little racing livery stripes on top. I'm gonna decide if I'm opening these. Got a few of these open already. Mercedes Benz G63 AMG. The 6x6 though. Go ahead with your bad self. They did great on that one. And then the 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 car the car I would consider the chase and, and you guys should really appreciate this car if you see it buy it because they didn't make very many they've only made one of these before and it's the 54 Jaguar D type they made one of these a long time ago it's like chunky it was green it wasn't done that well old tooling this is the one this Jaguar D type this thing was like blowing minds when it hit too back in the 50s they were still just like displacement and like they also knew to make cars lighter so things were just rockets and really no like boundaries you know there was there was nobody telling you you couldn't do that yet so oh i also got this and i'm i'm not you guys know me i'm not a big subaru guy but i do have all the colorways of the subaru svx I do think this is a special car for Subaru. I mean, I wish they would have made a V8. They'll never make one now because the V8's dying. But um, but that was a car that was ahead of its time. And I've got the white one. I've also got the uh, the premium, uh, not collectors, but the premium super fast version too. And, uh, just a cool car if you know about the car. So this is a Subaru Brat. That's a cool car. Sensible. Uh, yeah. Oh, well, I did go see the homie Matt. Big homie Matt from the PHP Mafia, people helping people. He hooked me up with this. I'd been looking for it. I heard the movie was actually really good, too. There's another Hot Wheels for you. And uh, when I got back, I stopped at the office, and it looks like I got a, a box from Chuck Isaac. Chuck Isaac. Charles. Chuck. I get it. Hey, bud. What, what are you? Thanks, man. I don't even know what it is, but I know you, so that's cool. What are you sending me, bruh? Chuck. Can I call you Chuck, I hope? I think Chuck's a cool name. Believe it or not, my knife is sharp, but Charles, uh, Chuck, that is. 
He put the in transit on here. Randomly cool. Zamac 69 Camaro. Oh, do not have that one. Whoa. Don't have this one either, do I? Sorry, pardon me, guys. Cool combi. Look at that artwork from the workshop family. And I do have one of these, but now I got one for the Lucy's. Whoa, Lucy's. Damn, really? Big ass, chunky Nova. Super Sport Nova in the golf livery. Chunky. Let me, let me do this a little better. Yeah, check out that golf. That Nova, look how chunky it is. Still works. Still got it. Ooh, is that a center? No, this is a, yeah, it is. A white center? Sorry, white center? Yes, brother. Dang, Charles. Oh, no. Here we go. Man, you're going to get me in my glasses, bro. So I don't know who makes this, but I think it's a Johnny Lightning. Or a Green Light, maybe. Yeah, Johnny Lightning. Johnny Lightning, T1. With some wheels. Check the wheels. We're good. There's a couple more Lucy's. I'm just going to leave my glasses on. Oh. Look at the Husky. It's Jackson. His eyes are just as crazy as Jackson's too. You guys can't see, but. Yo, that's cool. Thank you, man. Dude, like I say, must love dogs. Ooh, another really cool Johnny Lightning bug. You guys call them bugs or beetles? Oh, that thing goes. Charles, you got a video coming, brother. Ooh, I have this. But now, now, I have another one. <laughs> I love Lamborghini. Look at this Countach. 50th Grand Prix car. Oh, it's so wide, though. It barely fits on the track. I need this down. Oh, another Lucy. What is this Purple Passion? Okay, no, we're not going to go to the Lucy because there's cards on top. Some classic stuff. I do not have this first edition 40 Ford Coupe. Look at the flames. The new Tri 5 Gasser. That young Jada imports the Civic. Now this one's clean. Back when I was a Honda fella, I, I definitely wanted one of those. Oh, you're a classy, classy, classy dude. So I have this one, but I don't have it carded. I have a Lucy. Check out that 59 Impala. You know it's Impala with some triple tail lights, B. Thank you, bro. That young Godzilla. Er you guys have seen that? Bro, you really sending me this shit? Stuff. You know what you're sending me? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna give I'm gonna give the white one to Abby, but the red edition, Hello Kitty. And the other one. But the red edition, I've been with Oh, thank you, Broski. Oh, Chuck. Chuck, you did it, man. That's three cool combis. Well, two for me. Three. Right. 
Well, no, there's one more for me. Uh-oh. There's that. I don't know if that means anything. I got two of these Novas? Gangster. Double Nova. That's four combis. Volkswagens. Gosh, I'm in the market for a van, but just not there yet. What is this? You know I got that Aurora, right? I happen to have a couple Auroras. So, to have a stock racer, stock car racer Aurora, the Milestone Moments Hall of Fame. What's the Milestone Moment? Before the start of the 97 World Sports Car Race season, Jack Baldwin came to Mattel seeking Hot Wheels sponsorship and guaranteed he would win at Sebring. Jack drove for Robinson's Racing, who had just secured the Aurora as their car for the GTS 1 class for the 97 season. The Olds engine was a spin-off of the Cadillac North Star program. The Hot Wheels Old Aura was a crowd favorite at Sebring in March of 97 when Jack Baldwin and the Robinson Racing team beat Porsche and finished first in the GTS 1 class. Damn, that's like... That's claiming your home run. You know, that's... That's hard as nails, and it's a, it looks pretty true to, like, it's wide, it's, oh, I see, okay. you're a G, Chuck, you're a real, real distinguished gentleman, I tell you what, oh, I knew it was a passion, I'll show you, oh, it turns to the right, no, it's straight, purple passion, and the red with the, what is that, the gold yellow? Hits. This is a car every every collector needs in their collection as a purple passion. And then, bro, did you really just do this to me? You hit me one time with the ba bay combi party. It's the Barbie combi dragster. Er Chuck. Chuck, you got some real stuff here, man. What do you got? What's your collection look like if this you're sending over? So this looks like a Target exclusive Hot Rod Magazine Editor's Choice. The Anglia Panel Truck. Wait, what did I say? Yeah, Anglia Panel Truck. Hot Rod, 10 second, 10 second car. You owe me a 10 second car. And it has, again, Target on a packaging, so it's a Target exclusive. Looks like there's a number of cars in this set. Yeah. This is. I don't have any cards like this, bro. Thank you, man. 16 car set. I don't know if you guys have this set, but I'd like to see some of the rest of these cars too. Got a Roadrunner. You Google it. Google. Cheers. Thank you, Chuck. Man. That's what's up. Stitching a little video for you. For this to say thank you I appreciate you with your cars riding I got my cars up here too I forgot to show you guys what else I got too I was out there on the road to get this cyan majorette the little French company love it because they're moving parts so Opening boot, opening door, right behind that was this, the Bugatti Chiron Pure Sport. This car is ridiculous. Well, here, no, let's talk about the Cyan. Cyan, super pissed off, lightweight, Aventador is what that is. 
but you get you still get that bonkers ass 12 cylinders but you also get some like cyber security because you get uh it's it's a hybrid you normally see hybrids with like four cylinders three cylinders v6s 12 crazy car crazy fast but it really ain't shit compared to the bugatti excuse my french the bugatti goes zero to 100 kilometers in 2.3 seconds that's 62 miles an hour so that's like bro 1500 horsepower w16 by turbo just stupid fast stupid fast majorette does really good in there on their stuff too if you ask me so very happy pick up there it came to another box too this is from Elliot Lamke Essexville, Michigan Lots of discount beer. Yes. I gotta head over to my local uh, gas station slash Hot Wheels hunting spot slash sell beer. They, they, they have lots of sell beer. Let's see. Gosh, and it's good beer too. Seltzers. Oh, sorry. Sorry, guys. Sorry. It's beer and seltzers and stuff. Wait, Lamke, what is... Whoa. There's a lot going on here, man. Hey, Walter. Hope this box of things can be of use for your collection or to help the channel. Love your show and the views. I used to work for a PR media company and traveled a ton. I've fallen in love with the Western US. The green light in the box is from a fellow collector and coworker of mine who also watches. That's... It's so crazy still to think people are watching me. I can read a lot better with my glasses on too. <laughs> Damn it. Um, I'm happy these will be put to use rather than sitting in a drawer. The STH I found is the 68 Mazda Cosmo. Best wishes and full peg vibes. Dude, Lord of mercy, I'm sending you full peg vibes. But there's a lot more than just an STH and a green light in here, y'all. Bro. Party time. Whoa! Oh, thank you, man. Thank you for saving me from driving. Essentially three hours. That's just a drive. To find the Zamax I needed there. Wow, cool combi day. Cool combi day. Cool. And old Matt and Debbie. They're cool, too. And there's Amex. Retro Racers is looking up, dude. Oh, snap. That's what it looks like. Lord have mercy. I've been trying to find this for so long. Since last year, obviously. Finally, the chase piece, the Nitro Tailgater to the uh, 54th anniversary set. Dang, that's cool looking too. It's got turt like, oh, the parachutes. Thought it was a jet in it. Big ol'. <sighs> Got 
gosh, that's cool. There's a lot of stuff in here, man. I haven't seen this one. The Wrecking Wrench. Got the Young Hot Wheels Skate Wrecking Wrench, Tony Hawk. Also, the Treasure Hunt version. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm looking at the back. The Treasure Hunt version of that, which I do have already. That's stoked. We can definitely throw that in the box for folks, too. Oh, you got Chris's. You got the blind team board with the Rasta. Who do check? Ultra rares. Ultra rares. The tech decks are up here, Ellie. Sick. Um, I'm turning it around. Sorry. Gosh, man, I need a bigger desk or something. Dude, there's a grip of tech decks in here, man. Hold on. Did you quit skating or something? These are all the ultra rares. Because that finesse is an ultra rare. This team blind is an ultra rare. Dude, really? How do you, how did you? Bro, are you just a super hunter or what? This DGK one is so good. These are the graphic changers. Sorry. Sorry guys, sorry, sorry. Um, Sent me the chocolate, ultra rare. This DGK is so cool. It's a, uh, it's uh, like the Hot Wheels stickers. It changes. It's, it's, it's sick. Ultra rare. Wow, man. The Pudwell ultra rare. Ooh, sick. Jason Lee. The legend. If you guys don't know who Jason Lee is, you you should look him up. Um, this isn't an ultra rare, but it's a board you, you can't find because people who people who know know who Jason Lee is. Jason Lee is one of the skaters I saw as a kid. He's responsible for like a good three sixty flip, great style. You guys might know him from. Uh, Google him for skateboarding for sure, but you'll know him from uh, My Name is Earl, Mall Rats, uh, gosh, so many movies you guys would know him from, but uh, sick. Elliot, bro, broski. Look at all these tech decks. Do Crooked Ultra Rare. Look at that. Look at this diamond. On the flip, the diamond and flip collabo. Because diamond's actually a hardware brand, but they collab with all the beasts. Yes. Another blind with the tools. Oh, this is another grizzly, but this is the this isn't a changer, the grizzly one. Sorry guys, I know I know you guys probably think Hot Wheels, but I'm a collector of things with wheels. How about the Skate Mafia Jam? Skate Mafia, it's the San Diego dudes. Whew. DGK got pretty much the whole man. I'm gonna have to add a peg or two, Elliot. Looks like a couple more. Yes, flip and a Santa Cruz. Have I seen this one? This is an ultra rare, yeah. Yeah, this flip is an ultra rare. The Santa Cruz isn't, but it's Santa Cruz. All you need to know. 
mountain of tech decks. But he wants me to put all this stuff on it too. Like to tee it off too. That's a sick casting. And the special feature is, I can't remember. It's the top, right? It blows off. Oh, Retro Racer Edition. Matt and Debbie's in white. It's supposed to be pink. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I skate, so I'm going to forever. Ooh, I don't have that one either. There's Matt and Debbie Hayes's. That's the one that got him all the attention. But Tony Hawk, got to have the Grom. I have a ton of these now. And then a really cool hot truck set one. I don't have this one. The Too Tough. I guess it's probably not a licensed truck for the hot truck set. I got quite a few hot trucks. Ooh. Now that, sir, is a cool concept vehicle that probably needs to be freed the Chrysler Atlantic look at this thing it looks like uh, with those windows like the old Bugattis oh. that is a stunning vehicle why didn't they make it it's all in here oh oh thank heaven because I well I put it back I kept grabbing it. I grabbed it twice, maybe. The Bored Wild Monster Truck. Mountain boarding's fun. You guys ever tried that with big old off-road tires? Wait, what's this? This is really cool. Hold on, guys. It's... This green light? Are these little wheels? Gotta be a... Gotta be a green light. Yeah, green light. Oh, so cool. So cool. T2 transporter. Truck from green light with the removable, like Kwanzaa hut thing. <laughs> but just, this is the stuff you had to, you had to pay that chicken tax for to get over here. They do so good on their castings. These little chintzy wheels kind of roll sometimes. Oh, shoot. There's more. This is, this is heavy. Is this a gold bar? Oh. This is cool. Sorry. The Raw Hogan it's an indie car, and it's like, I guess maybe like one, I don't know what scale it is, one. Shell livery Motorola. Here's the other one. Here's the other one in black, the T94. Oh, brother. I can't wait to do some research on these, man. Elliot. He <laughs> Yeah, bro. You already know, I guess. Hold on. First up, I see two super cool paint tooligans. The skate tool. Ooh. Who don't have this? This one with the moving guy. Yeah. 
Okay, the F1 Racer Hot Wheels. Got the little pilot in there because they don't always put the pilot in them. Another one with pilot. Check. Whoa. How are they going to dry this? Hey, man, let me dry the boat. Whoa, and that is a 10, V10? Well, it's a V10. It's called the Honda something. It's got two drivers in it. That is messed up, man. The Honda Racer. Does that make sense? Oh, we're going to need the axle straightener for that. I don't have one. I've been thinking... Oh, wow. Corgi. This Corgi old F1 racer. Probably even used it for hill climb stuff. People do that back there. They do anything. Back there, over there, Europe. Also has driver and cockpit. Wow, dude, this is old. Pardon me. I don't know. I don't know a year, but I'm going to do some research. Holy jeez, Elliot. And Chuck. You guys blessed it. I got issues right now. I don't know if I'm throwing that Matt and Debbie's T-Bird Zamac in the Zamac collection shelf or in the Retro Racers shelf. Probably Retro Racers. That makes sense, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. Gosh, you're a G. Whew. Look at all these tech decks. Oh, in real talk, I got, I got to make room to. Uh, show you more cars so bear with me